Okay, February 2nd. Oh no, wait. Yeah, February 2nd. Here we are. And this is all I got from Aldi. It was $19.62. Can't see the receipt, but it was $19.62. Four boxes of cornflakes. Um, two spaghetti. Two soy sauce. I wanted to try this Polynesian sweet and spicy hot sauce. And then a con sweetened condensed milk. Nineteen. .60. Also went to Publix and got this stuff. And let me see what the receipt says. So I got these six Kavita. Or not Kavitas, but um, what do you call it? Kombucha. Lemon ginger flavor. And then these items here. And the total for this came up to... I can find it, $171.62. $171.62. We got um, low fat yogurt, whole milk yogurt, lettuce, two Swiss cheeses, red potatoes, a crunchy and a creamy peanut butter, grapes, three honeycrisp apples, four plums, an avocado, two bunches of bananas, halos, three beefsteak tomatoes, green onions, two that I decided to put the milk on there, so that's what happened. So two of these breads, three gallons of milk, two dozen eggs, four of these white grape juices, and again, one seventy-one sixty-two. Okay, I went to Dollar Treats February 4th, and I got these stable shelf milks. And a bag of soft mints, Arizona iced tea. Um, these mints, which they were sold out for a long time. And then I'm gonna try these hot and spicy peanuts. And I think everything I got came up to $34. Okay, I just got back from Bargain Hunt. Today's January 5th, and I spent uh, $93.74 at Bargain Hunt. And that does include some non-food items. So I got these socks for $5, these socks for $6, and these socks for $6. But it does include all that Velveeta cheese. Velveeta, not cheese, shells and cheese. So eight boxes, expiration date on them are February 5th. But that's okay. I can work these into our lives and that should be fine. Um, so we got eight boxes of liquid gold. And so I think it comes down to, I paid $7.50 a box. They were $15 a box. They were marked down to $7.50 a box. So we'll just work these out into upcoming meals. And then here we have Capri Sun, which was $6 for three containers, which is not super cheap. This one expires October 2023. And that's that. Okay, it is January, or not January, February 5th, and I just got back from Walmart, and these are all the things I got. Came up to $319.52. Um, so I'll just go through everything I got. Grabbed a tub of ice cream, a bag of Honeycrisp apples, um, cough drops, a raspberry vinaigrette, another Clorox bleach foamer, um, sesame oil, fish sauce, baking sheets, cookie baking sheets, coconut oil, craisins, two coconut flakes, two suavitels, um, four bags of nuggets, 10 of these plates, 10 of these bowls, 10 of these cups, and then 10 of these dinner plate bowl things. Um, two packages of ramen noodle, two olive oils, a package of dry erase markers, socks for a kid, socks for another kid, two grape jams, um, one strawberry jam, vitamins for kids, a toothbrush for my little Hazy, um, honey vanilla chamomile, southwestern mustard, bleach, four of these imitation vanillas, honey, caramel and that came up to 319.52 okay today is the i don't know what today is today is the 12th 12th thank you and we just got back from sam's club sent 329 on what you see here i'm about to go through it in a second so 
we got two bags of honey crisp apples um three bags of these sliced strawberries two of these caramel and cheese mixed popcorn one probably cheese ritz crackers glad bags kleenex animal crackers we actually had two of these we already ate one whole one um Lafia, butter string cheese detergent bacon two trays of chicken thighs um onions sweet onions a 50 pound bag of rice and baby wipes and that came to three oh and this platter we're going to a super bowl party today so we kind of dropped it so that's why it looks like that but it's fine and so everything here came to 329 and some change okay february 13th just got back from walmart spent 109 dollars and some change hazel's crying <sighs> grab brillo some plain yogurt for a oh, some plain yogurt for a project or something or other hopefully you can hear me um more of this raspberry walnut vinaigrette cilantro lime always vanilla extract honey always coconut milk always bleach foamer always i needed this for a cookbook that um i have picked up so i grabbed that um linguine because they didn't have spaghetti and so i went with that coconut oil always three gallons of milk fine um a loaf of that bread um light red kidney beans i'm gonna try to soak my own beans possibly start canning or freezing them haven't decided which one diced tomatoes with chilies um olive oil always for bread fennel seed for the cookbook um this uh unflavored gelatin for the cookbook and these cumin seeds for the cookbook and then a 25 pound bag of flour because mm -hmm. always need that 109 that came to february 20th aldi order here picked up small one order 59 dollars and some change so got two dozen eggs the block bags small thing of blueberries um four of these um sausages two syrups three gallons of milk and four apple juices and two crates of strawberries just over here that came up to 59 dollars and some change finish editing the february grocery budget and i see that we are so much over budget sorry if you hear kids yelling in the background but i'm just looking at my we spent one thousand one hundred and thirty five dollars and fifty cents and the budget is like what is it let me see 550 or is it 500 it might be okay let's see 1135 dollars minus 500 minus 160 so we're 475 dollars over budget this month so better than last month um but still not good so we're gonna keep rolling through these and let's see what we do for march coming up thanks for watching and see you in another video